once I was preaching at a secular university. And as I was preaching on the atonement, this student stood up and he said, I got a question for you. I said, what? How can one man suffering for a few short hours on a cross save a multitude of men, a countless multitude, according to you, of men from eternal judgment? I said, son, you meant it for evil, but God will mean it for good. Thank you for that question. Now sit down. You want to know how that one man dying alone for a few short hours on a tree can save a multitude of men from an eternity in hell because that one man is worth more than all of them put together. You take mountains and molehills, crickets and clowns. You take everything, every planet, every star, every form of beauty, everything that sings, everything that brings delight, and you put it all in the scale, and you put Christ on the other side, and He outweighs them all. He outweighs them all. <laughs> Brethren, this is the one we chase after. Go to your studies. Go to your studies. Flee there. Not to become smarter than the next man. But to behold his glory. Until it hurts you. And disintegrates you. And reconstitutes you. And makes you a preacher. <laughs> 